Howdy guys, welcome back to Let's Play Mother 3. So we are in the room with all the hostages. Man, there's a whole bunch more of them here. Yeah, you want to be a pig mask? Well, you're halfway there. Master Peggy takes, Master Peggy takes very good care of us. Oh, that's sick. You? No, you probably don't. Wait, what? Your attention, please. You appear quite exhausted there, Lucas, but the real fun is just about to begin. Alright, climb up those stairs just ahead. Come on, don't disappoint me now. <laughs> oh, are you now? A nice person this morning? Probably not. Happy, happy, happy. I'm so happy today. Isn't that what the clown sings in Mrs. Doubtfire? Yum. Hmm. Ew. Don't talk to me about that. That's nasty. Wait. You guys are sick, you know that? Oh, wow. Save frog. There was just a save frog out there. Wait a minute. Can you save at that one? Glub glub. Save your game. No. Okay, I sure will. Hey, guy. The frog in the next room says hello. Alright. Now, I feel like I've done my duty as a person to pass that message right along to the next frog. Oh boy, here we go. This is the part I didn't want to do. I'm pleased to see you've made it this far. I will determine if you fit to meet with Master Pokey or not. Kind of follow me if you would. Alright. So, Master Porky just loves to play fun games while I use the Super Whack-A-Mole game to judge whether or not you're fit to be a wonderful playmate of his. What? I didn't say I want to be his playmate. I want to kick his ass, man. The rules, okay. Whoever hits the most moles, blah blah blah. Basically what this is here, what you have to do here, is play these games against Porky, but it's not really gonna be Porky, it's gonna be like a robot Porky or something. I don't even remember actually. But the thing of it is, you actually have to just like barely let him win so that it's really exciting, you know, so it seems like he really is close to you in skill. Like if you just let him totally kick your ass, it's not he's not gonna be happy with that. Uh-huh. So he goes first, and he whacks some moles, and fortunately, I do believe they cut to the end of this. Because look at this, how- oh my god, it's sleep-inducing is what it is. Wow, simply amazing, you hit a grand total of ten moles. Alright, you're up, Master Lucas, so what you have to do is hit nine moles. So here we go. One, two, three... Four, five, six, seven. Uh, did that count? I don't know. Eight, nine. Now we just stand here for the rest of the round and wait for time to run out. I'm not sure what that man's head is doing coming out of there. I'm guessing you lose a point if you hit that. Jeez, look at that guy. Are they actually? Do they actually have a human down there sticking his head up through the hole? Like, I guess that's better than soaking in green liquid, huh? So here we go. Now for the results. Master Lucas's record. Ta-da! Total moles hit nine. All right. Oh my! Master Mini Porky, you've won the intense match by the razor-thin margin of one mole. What a wonderful game! Truly heart-stopping. Now then, let's move on to the next one. So we have to do this for two more games, and this is why I said I didn't want to do this part because ah, oh, it's just. It's disheartening, is what it is. Or something. Oh, here's part two. Alright, things are really heating up now. Okay, I probably should have mentioned that guy standing up there holding the sign. You might have seen him before it scrolled away. Hey, that looks like Yoshi's Island. Well, that guy actually has a clue for you as to what you have to do to progress, not necessarily to win. <clears throat> because if you win, well, you're just gonna get... You have to start over, or get game over, or something. So, I had actually a lot of trouble with this one, so I don't know, I might save state this or something. Because I really don't want to have to do this two times. Anyway. This is written on the cue card. Your fly's open, XYZ. Isn't it supposed to be CYZ? Jeez. You're much manlier now. <laughs> Alright. Okay, so what do we do now? All right, on your mark, get set, go is when you start, okay? All right, on your mark, get set, go, go, go! Oh, wow. Oh, I can't move, I'm too senile. Ugh. 
the alligator's gonna eat me! What's he doing up there? Uh, oh, I don't know how to make this interesting. Shark, eat me, please! No problem, here. So we'll get right up to the finish line, and I'm gonna... Shit, wait. Oh my! Master Mini Pork, you win the intense match by a nose! What a truly fantastic race! That was a match for the ages. Now that... Thank God. I tried to, like, save my state, but I was afraid I'd save it too late. So I didn't do anything. And just hoped that I'd got it right. And I did, so thank God. And another save frog, just in case you were low on health or something from all this terrible... Or from all this, you know, this mutilation that we're going through here. Please come this way if you would. I don't really want to, but okay. The final game is, To Whom Goes the Boom? Alright, here's a quick explanation of the rules. Use your mental A button, blah blah blah, yeah. So basically, whoever pops their balloon first is the winner. So, what you're gonna want to do is, um... Oh! He's tripling the points, so I can come from behind to win it all! Oh yeah, that's intense. So I think all you really have to do here is get your balloon up to its biggest size. And, uh... There we go. I think that did it. Yes! Thank god, you're so young, yet you've mastered so much. I hereby deem you fit to meet Master Porky. Now then, please go and pay Master Porky a wonderful visit! Cool, alright. Man, look at this place. How many staircases have we got? Oh, it's a couch. Yeah, let's take a nap. Jeez. I'm exhausted from all that losing on purpose. My mom used to lose on purpose to one of my stepdad back when they played Tetris, because he would get really mad. And, you know, he would say, I suck and I'm stupid and all this stuff. <gasps> man, oh man, what is that? God, this is 7 minutes and 22 seconds into the video. Lucas, welcome to my room. This is the real 100th floor that you've wanted to come to oh so badly. Again, I welcome you, my beloved detestable pests. I was the one who invited you here, so you're free to come inside if you wish. It's just, I've given orders to let no one enter my room, to that little attack toy you see right there. Who knows, maybe this is where I'll say goodbye, even though I invited you here. Alright, let's turn it on. Say hello to the natural killer cyborg. Oh boy, 